Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Go Truck Show on Go Truck TV. It's today, and you know what that means. It's time for another draft week battle. We are up against Jumping Shiny Frogs in week five of the MBTL Random League. They've brought Salamence, Mega Slowbro, Gyarados, Verizon, Mew, and Torn. Okay, I'm trying to think if there's anything. No Vulpix is of note. No Dux Defense, no Grass, no Starmie. They have like five Psychic types and three Flying types. It's a lot. Um, okay. I'm glad not to see Vulpix, which sounds really weird, but it can kind of hard counter Alola Tails, which I don't super want. Um, do I think we just lead Alola Tails? Unless I just go to Zama. Check. I just go to Zama. It's not ideal. I don't really have. Actually, I'm going to leave Blay out. Go aggro. I didn't bring clearing, so. If I go calmly. Then it's a roll. And I can will a wisp if you try to dance. I'm gonna will wisp, and then if you a dragon is, I can jump back out. Uh, I mean, I could double shadow well to try to take it out that way. That feels better, actually. Okay, they just went for it. That's fine. Means I'm either at play. Take the speed boost. There's no way this kills. This will tell me if you're scarf or not. So that's good. Uh, Limthor does up to 90. Up to. Key is up to 44. Woohoo! Woohoo! That's a salt vest if I ever seen one, ladies and gentlemen. And like super max HP assault vest. Woo, nearly. Ain't that just a kick in the teeth? It feels like you should go Verizon. Um, I 
But me clicking size on. One, one, that well. The whole thought process there was, well, at least I'll be in range of, um, I'll put Mew in range of Greninja, even if this goes worse. I forgot the leaf's life. Yeah. And that's why I hate Hoopa you. You think you have everything covered, but it's too slow and just drops to everything. Ah. That's super frustrating. Um, that's not the right Zambacenta. Oh, I didn't nickname you. That's why. Um. This is gonna go badly. I can feel it. I'm playing so bad around you, but okay. If you are packing iron defense, I'm gonna feel quite silly. Iron defense. Oh, you definitely have it. Okay. So I want to crunch into wild charge. at 55 against oh yeah we're fine okay scarf And if I okay, it does stop the fail. Okay. 
you're gonna have clearing of some sort. But that's okay, I don't flap them. Um, you have psychic things. Aha! I'm playing so bad. If I grab Apple into Sucker Punch, I think that works. Grab Apple does 40. It's only going to work if they're no HP, which I don't think they are. Flapple! <laughs> I need to just outrage Casey Drake. Let's go, they missed wing beat. Wait, Alola Tails is great. Nothing I can do, but... If they close combat, we have to hope they high roll me into Zalek. Which I hate. 
No. Self in case you twitch. I don't think I live this. Yeah, that was kind of a weird one. I I didn't play well. Um, I I mean, I think I made it clear. I don't met. I know last week my opponent was trying to tell me I had the best team in the league, but I really don't blend with my team that well. Um, also, this is why I hate Life Orb. Ah, why did I run Life Orb? If I was E Belt, I think I have a chance. Actually, I don't know. Uh, Torrenty was like super AD. Actually, you have a chance. I'm just being salty. Yeah, no, no, he was definitely a range of um, Gren. So it had to have been like Evil and get freeze. Yeah, my team, it just, it's so weak to scarf. And. It's it's got a big attack stack stats and big stat totals, but it can't get kills with any of them. Like they're really weird attack totals. Like I've always had the issue with Bicephalon is it just it's so frail, you have to get that kill and it misses it. A lot of the time, obviously, it's best used as a cleaner, but which I did not do in this match at all, which is probably a mistake, but. Um, it was just not right. I don't know. I guess I should have just gone flap. But if you, I go Flapple and Gyarados, it's faster. It just takes it out. So then I have to go Zamazenta. Then I'm eating an Earthquake. 
which doesn't feel good because then I'm not going to be able to take out the bruh. Yeah, I don't know. The Verizon was, I knew it was such a challenge in prep because I had to hit it. So they did a good job of preserving it. Um, I should just click Dark Pulse with Hoopa. It would have had a chance to kill. Um, yeah. I always knew that 50 was going to be Witch Bay. And that's my problem. is I, I run into spots with this team where I have to play perfect and not miss a read. I miss 150-50 and I'm so far behind that I'm scrambling to try to get anything and I mean, Sal, like I'm, and I'm running stuff like Salix, and I'm running have to run speed boosting Blissafalon because I can't run just seventeen scarves. Like my team has speed, but it's weirdly like not it can't do speed stuff. And then anybody can bring Trick Room and just destroy me too. Um, like I had to bring my own Trick Room on a scarf Hoopa as my only out to Trick Room. Which, like, threw away the Scarf Foot Vessel. But, like, nor that was in prep, uh, not in play, because, as I said, we didn't play well this game. Um, I find when I'm only in one league and other stuff going on, I just, I'm not playing enough Pokemon that you get into league battles and it's like, oh, there's things and stuff, and I always get too aggro. Um, yeah, we, we tried here, but uh, I don't, yeah, I think I had to hit the Salad. I think that was the O. Because it just dropped a Verizion. I couldn't go into it. I had to go into Tails. I suppose hindsight, if I... But it, the two, minus two didn't kill, right? So I would have had to have gone for... F actually, with the Hail Chip. Would it have? Was it at? It's gonna play. Da, 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 da. No, it was at full. So one turn of chip, two turns of chips puts it to eighty-eight. If I'd subbed, and then they hit into the sub. It's a third turn of chip. Yeah, that was the play. I didn't actually look at the numbers of the percentage. I just saw the range. And I really quickly looked at the range and I looked at it wrong. I should have subbed. That, that's the odds. Um, now, obviously, if they switch out, it's a little different situation. But... Um, where Veil was by far the better play, but I think you have to play those odds. I don't think they switched there. That feels like a mistake. Because Vaidu... There is low rolls that could get me two. Um, but then the third round of chip. But I don't win that. Or wait, I do. Yeah, actually... Yeah, I think that was the play. I had to sub there. I should have done those odds. Because I this way I relied on a 37. The other way, I wasn't. And I could still make the choice. But it, it backfires if they hit the high roll. And then I sub, obviously. Um, but then I'm Salak, no sub. Then I just have to high roll them in return. Maybe at 92. That would be a pretty high roll, though. 37, same odds. Yeah, I made the mistake. I 100% sure something. Anyways, have a great day, everybody, because Coach Oak said so. Goodbye and good night, Bob and Bang.